these are some safety items you might want to have on your boat. First thing is we have is a fire extinguisher. These are rated 5 BC. This one's auto and marine fire extinguisher. Works on flammable liquids and electrical equipment. Um, has a six year warranty, fights most car and boat fires. It's rated by UL. It's dry chemical. Um, if you get one of these, you have to read this part, this label right here. It tells you, it says U.S. Coast Guard Fire Extinguisher Requirements. From 0 to 25, 26 feet, a boat, you need one of these. If your boat is 26 to 40 feet, you need two of them. Or 40 to 65, you need three of them. And you have to read that, because if your boat's higher or lower than... 26 feet, and you know how many you need. This is what it looks like. This is a standard little disposable fire extinguisher. It has a pressure gauge. Tells what fires it can be used on. These come with a special bracket that have straps on them. You have to have these straps on there when you mount this extinguisher because since it's on your boat, it rocks around stuff and it could get knocked off. You have to put it on a solid surface and then put these little straps around it so that they're strapped. Sometimes it's hard to strap them. And that's all it requires is you do that. And they come with an uh, inspection tag. you got to fill that out and put on there as well. And that's, that's about it for the fire extinguisher. Another thing is an air horn. It's a simple little small standard air horn. You can buy these at most stores that sell both boat stuff, supplies, same with the fire extinguisher. And another thing is a road flare. You can put these on your boat too, so if you get stuck, same thing with the air horn. This is just the air horn's a backup for this. You can get these in the car section of an automotive store or any place else car stuff because they, they come like a pack of four. It costs about five bucks, I think. And a first aid kit. I got this for about eight bucks at Walmart. You can get these anywhere too. It's just in a like medical equipment aisle. Now, a few things mine has that it didn't come with that you should think about putting in here if you're gonna put this in your boat. It has instructions that came with it. Tells if you get hurt or something, you can fix up. A flashlight. Make sure it works every month or so, and check your fire extinguisher too when you do this. And a box of matches. Because if you get stuck or something and you need something like matches to use for something that you need in an emergency, you have them. And this is stuff is just stuff that came with it. This is like survival wrap says. Oh, another thing you might want to get to put in here some scissors. Because it didn't have any. It has things like gauze and stuff you might need if you need to use it. You need to cut it. It's got this medical tape. Huge box of band-aids. An ice pack. A glow stick. Cream. more band-aids and stuff it's got little tablets of medicine Tylenol stuff like that so if you get a headache or something or somebody needs some of that there's a tongue depressor down in there huge band-aids and these are like just wipe them uh, kind of sanitizer wipes you can use there's tweezers in here um there's just mo usually a lot of band-aids because there's like all different sizes of band-aids. There's standard ones like it's in this box. There's those huge kind like it shows. There's little kind. There's all kinds of stuff in here. This is really a good thing to have. Basic, but out of all these things, the things you want to have is the first aid kit and the fire extinguisher because they're the most important. And if your boat has a gas engine instead of just like a trolling motor, if that's a gas engine, you have to have a fire extinguisher or the Coast Guard will find you or something like that. But you have to have a fire extinguisher on your boat. Uh, you don't have to have this, but if you wanted to, you can get these. They're fire extinguisher signs at uh, your fire equipment store. You can look, like, look under your phone, look on your phone book and see fire extinguishers. And I'll tell your name for your local fire extinguisher store. You can get these, they're just a sticker that says fire extinguisher inside. 
I said if I was going to put this in my cabinets on my boat, I could put it in there. And I could put this sticker on there so if somebody needed to find the fire extinguisher or whatever, like the first aid kit, they could find it. If you have any questions, just post them on my YouTube page.